One time for Dream Kings, I support them. Number one film and company in the, in the city, baby. Youth football. Dream King Films, we're here Range Vikings head coach Donovan Mashline. Hey, coach, it's National Signing Day. You mm -hmm. just had two of your players, uh, Ken Kirkland and Jamar Whitehead, sign their national letter of intent to further their academic and athletic career. Coach, real quick, just talk about that moment. Uh, it's a special moment, you know, for them and, you know, their family. Uh, you know, they've worked hard uh, for this moment. Uh, they put the work in uh, academically and, you know, athletically, you know, Kenton four years and Jamar three years. So I'm excited about uh, what they're going to be able to do uh, moving forward you know, at Georgia Southern and also at Florida State University. Coach, uh, Georgia Southern, Jamar Whitehead, he made it official to the uh, to Georgia Southern University. Just talk about him and what makes him such a special player, Coach. Uh, he's a versatile player that's, you know, a smart intellectual uh, player that, you know, He's quiet off the field, but on the field, he turns it on. Uh, he has a high motor. Um, he's always going to be in the right position, and he's going to work to make plays. And, you know, they he fits what Georgia Southern wants in a linebacker. And, uh, you know, they have a great plan for him. Uh, they're going to play him all over the defense, rush in, Mike linebacker, outside linebacker. So uh, I think it was, a, it was a good fit, you know, for his, you know, the staff that they have. Um, also, the position coach, the linebacker coach, you know, he has an outstanding resume. So that's one thing that stuck out to uh, Jamari. So uh, I'm excited for what he's going to be doing up there in Statesboro. Coach, what do you think Jamari's uh, best attribute is? Uh, getting after the quarterback. You know, he has a relentless effort uh, getting after the quarterback. Um, and just, just get, making sure everybody's in the right place at the right time, uh, getting lined up. And, you know, he, he's a natural-born leader uh, through, you know, his work. Uh, through the examples that he leads with and uh, also both of Coach Ken Kirkland, he signed with uh, Florida State University. Just talk about that real quick. Uh, that's a, that's one of the uh, biggest uh, signees uh, in, the, in recent years. You know, we had Quincy last year with Cincinnati, but, um, you know, on a Power 5 kid, you know, we probably hadn't had one since, um, I believe it was, you know, Solomon Kinley and, you know, Rick Wells going and um, also uh, Twin going to Iowa State. So, um, it's good to get that back going, um, get kids going Power 5 from Reigns High School. I'm excited, man, for what he's going to be able to do. Uh, Coach Woodson, Coach JP, you know, Coach Norvell, you know, they're very high on uh, his ability. That's why, they, you know, he's enrolling in uh, January. So I'm excited. He's excited. You know, the parents are excited. And uh, I'm just happy, man. They trusted the process. They trusted the plan uh, that they put in place that we talked about at this uh, freshman season. And uh, I'm just happy that it all comes to fruition right now. Also, talk about uh, Ken's skill set and what you feel his best attribute is, Coach. Um, you know, he's long rangy. Um, you know, he can play corner, he can play slot corner, he can move to safety. So I think the versatility, um, you know, kind of reminds you of a Jalen Ramsey type type guy. Um, but I think, you know, just his hips, his speed, uh, and his long arms, being able to play deep ball, uh, it's one thing that, you know, works in his favor. So, and also, he's a smart football player as well. That's why he's able to play so many positions. So uh, it's going to be special, you know, to see him on Saturdays uh, where they're going in the goal. Coach, we've seen the film. Everybody's seen the playing person. So we know what type of players these guys are on the field. But can you just talk about what kind of players these guys are off the field, Coach? Oh, they role models, you know, inside the school. You know, they, they do it the right way. Jamari with a 4.02 GPA. Kirkland with a 3.7 GPA. So, it's you know, they come from great, great stock and parents. Um, so they, they're just a role model. Uh, for anybody, not just, you know, range athletes, but, you know, great character. You know, we've never had to um, discipline them in, you know, in matters that, you know, was detrimental. Um, you know, they've always been positive. Um, you know, any message that I need to relate to the team, it goes through them first. Um, so, you know, I take pride in, you know, having a relationship with all my kids. But, you know, some kids going to have, you know, a, a tighter relationship. You know, that's just come with the territory. But I'm just proud of them. Um, you know, for what they've done for the program and for what they've done for, you know, themselves and also their teammates. Coach, last question before we get out of here. We all know what uh, Reigns represents, Coach, but to all the little kids that's looking up to the Reigns Vikings, just talk about how important grades is in this whole entire process right Man, here, Coach. if you don't have grades, you don't play. No grades, no play. You don't graduate. You don't get a chance to have a scholarship because you have to be able to get into a college uh, first and foremost through academics. Uh, Coach can want you you know, really, really, really bad. But if, if you don't have the academics to go along with your athleticism, you know, you, you're working for nothing. So, you know, just stay encouraged, man. Make sure you get your grades right. Make sure you, 
you know, do everything that your teachers are telling you to do because at the end of the day, uh, when it's time for recruiters to come in, the first thing they're going to do is stop in guidance office and get transcripts. So you want to make sure that your transcript, it, you know, it shows who you are off the field and uh, it matches what you're going to do on the field because what you do in the classroom translates and correlates to how you play on the football field. Coach, thanks for talking with me. Good luck to your future. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate you. One time for Dream Kings, I support them. Number one filming company in the city, baby. Youth football.